this can be a continuous process. We talked a little bit about that before, and I think on the next slide there's a machine that shows you what that what that looks like. Um, two ways that that can be that can be done. Um, one is if you imagine this bowl thing, but then stretch it out so it looks like a racetrack. Okay, you could put the parts in here and it tumbles around the racetrack and then out the other side and comes out and the media just keeps just stays in in the racetrack the entire time. That's one way. You can generally get cycle times depending on the size up to about twenty minutes or so. So as long as your cycle time is less than twenty minutes, you're all good. Um, the other way is to take, like Ty was explaining before, really long tubs. So you put the parts in this end, they tumble all the way to the other end. Everything gets discharged out the door, okay? The parts go onto a screen or a magnetic separator or whatever the case may be. They get kind of conveyed away and the media falls onto a conveyor, which conveys everything back up here and then drops it back into the front with the parts. And so that's another way to do a continuous kind of a process.